I'm going to try something new with this new deck that I have. But, um, I'm going to shout out to my lawyers supporters. Like, the ones that have been watching my channel, the ones that have been laughing, saying, <laughs> no, liking the video. This is for you. The main, I just want to think. Thank you for all of the support, like, the overwhelming of just love, you know. And you guys really keep me on my toes regardless of what it is. So, so far we have cancer, so I want to tune into this deck that I have. So far we have Instinct Bliss. Um... We have the pain hidden by luxury, okay? We have the lower and higher self. We have the promise of unending love, the temptation of pleasure, and reaching outward, okay? It could be 26, 33, okay? This could be for a 13 year old, this could be for a 19 year old, this could be for a 6 year old, or a 14 year old. Like I said, I have between the age of 6 and 19, and 26 to 33. Okay. Um, life path number 6. Okay. Mm-hmm. So something could be happening six days, six weeks from now, thirteen days, fourteen days from now, nineteen days from now. Like I said. We have instinct bliss. You could be dealing with a Taurus or this could be a Taurus in the background that's watching. Just like this man or woman. Like, this could be an older gentleman that's looking. Like, look at this. Look how she just covered in bliss and flowers, and he just looking, taking notes. <laughs> um, this statue in the background could be an ancestor. Could be. But it's given an older gentleman, you know, or this is just. Someone that's a mine from afar. Okay, moving on. Um, we have the pain hidden by election. Um, you could be taking care of stuff, you could be neutral, but somebody think that it's pain hidden within luxury, and it's like, no. This right here is nothing but inner peace of love, harmony, structure, discipline. I'm moving forward. Like, she might look sad and sore, but no. In reality, she's just taking things day by day. You know, a woman loving themselves, seeing themselves, and just among their higher and lower self. Getting to know their higher and lower self, exactly, with the reflection of themselves, not what others perceive, not how others want them to be. But yeah, when you are connected with your higher and lower self, that's when you are able to sign that part as light that some people might not like. And then we have here is the promise of unending love. Like I said, self-love. It could be any type of love, unconditional. Like I said, regardless, it's unending. Like you see the roots from the bottom, nothing but growth. Planting new seed. Mm -hmm. Planting new ideas, new adventures. Best for moments, you know. Then we have here 
We have the temptation of pleasure. This could be self pleasure. This could be pleasing self. Not sharing with the next thing or feel. Looking back, reflecting. Mm hmm. That's self pleasure. That's self healing. Right there. This is all about healing and self love. But these two, the pain of hidden by luxury and the temptation of pleasure. Mm hmm. Admiring self in and out. And then we have reaching outward. Yeah, reaching outward to the divine. Focusing on your higher and lower self. And question and in mind that true desire within self. Yeah. This toe deck is mainly about giving and receiving. Just letting it flow. And just letting it be that it's not the pain hidden by luxury. It's mainly the tolerance, the bullshit, <laughs> the facade, the mask. It's all of that. And it's like, once you see it, once you know your confirmation, it just keep you moving, just keep you going forward. And it's like, you cannot be faced by it. You just have to focus on you. Um, you have your well being and not the outside. So, the outside is reaching out to the divine and focus on your higher and lower self. Minus the temptation that wants to come in and bring all that disgusting energy. Yeah, but we're gonna find out. I'm gonna put some colors on top of this. And see which the um why do we have instant bliss so far? Could this could be someone that's looking? Didn't I just say that it says comic demonic male? And this person knows that they are comic. This person that's looking from afar, watching from afar. They are really comic and look right on top of instant bliss. Yeah. Comic demonic male. Right on top of that. I'm gonna put that right there. So you can see. Um what else good? We have the husband on the deal. This is not gonna be for everybody, but you can see the truth. It says the pain hidden by luxury. This is not gonna be for everyone. And if you are male watching this, we could be saying such. Okay. It says sick. Somebody could be sick right now. Mm-hmm. The higher and your higher and lower self could be sick or you are being new. Um, okay. We have a group of males. This could be a group of males, comic demonic males. Like I said, the promise of unending love. Group of males, comic demonic male, right up under this. These are comics, or this could be comics in general that's trying to stop two people from coming together. This could just be them that's doing this. A whole group of them, and it says comic baby mama, somebody's comic baby mother. It says the temptation of pleasure, right up under somebody's husband on the deal, somebody. This could be somebody's comic baby mother. Okay, if you're a man watching this, you could be dealing with this. Mm -hmm. It's a threesome, something about a threesome. It says reaching out where, yeah, you could be finding out the truth. You could be shook, finding out from inside. Yeah, you're not shook. You can see. It says shook threesome. Somebody's on the deal, and he says, Comic baby mama, comic demonic male, group of males. It's just a lot of whole mix, mixed up shit. I said this person has two relationships, confirmation. Something about Twitter, you're gonna find something out on Twitter. And we have Trust Your Gut. Mm -hmm. 
like I said, something about an elder. I'm just pointing this out. Something about an elder gentleman that's watching from afar. Um, yeah. Um, I'm going to pick one of these. Or this could be a group of men that's doing this. Like, it's, it's a group of comic demonic males, and it's a group of males, including with them all day. And it says, when I'm a person with, I am a person with, I am a person with nothing but kindness, you know, like, not with this comic demonic energy, with group of males. Mm-hmm. Apology. Says, I'm still not over what happened. I would have appreciated an apology. Mm-hmm. Yeah, what else, baby? Small favor. I'm hoping you can help me with this with something small. Yeah, this is so we're gonna see what else come out. Didn't I just say this? It's a revenge. I'm looking to damage you in retaliation for perceived wrong. Didn't I just say this? Something tricky is gonna come up. Like I said, I don't believe in these. Any people when they say they want an apology, they want to do this and that, and that. it's nothing funny, it's nothing good with this. It's like this person in general is seeking revenge, and they could be doing it with a group of comic males, or this could be a group of comic males that's doing this, and they're trying to seek revenge. Hmm. And it's like, what the fuck? And it says greed, and it's nothing but greed. I'm pursuing work and power with no regard for ethical or the moral boundary here. This person is not sorry. This person is up to something and they say trust the gut because they are planning something within a group and you just have to be prepared for it. So yeah, don't ignore that gut thing because it's real. This person is out for revenge and you just have to be prepared and use your instinct. 